like to welcome you guys back to my channel. And if you're brand new here, subscribe if you like the videos. Sometimes they have okay videos. Now, with that out of the way, yes, I'm trying to pick up more subscribers as a show. With that out of the way, let's talk about the beard. Yeah, I made many videos about the beard, haven't I? <coughs> For those of you that's been with me for any length of time, you know through the winter months, I grow in the rest of my beard. I do it because I am a walker. I walk all winter long. I'm a hiker. I hike and I'm outdoors doing a lot of things. And I need to keep me face warm so I grow in the rest of my fur. This right here never goes nowhere. I do a lot of things every year to keep myself safe and keep myself from getting frostbite or keep myself from getting too cold. All the way down to my water bottles. Yeah, I put socks on my water bottles to keep them from freezing up. All the way down to the certain clothing I got. It's underneath my jacket, I have a thermal. And then I have my walking shirt. And this jacket is very thin. It's a walking jacket. So, I always go to certain measures depending on the temperatures. So, why not grow in the facial beard? It works, guys. It's been a couple years I didn't grow in the beard, and I should have. And my face froze in one particular year, one particular day, I thought I almost had frostbite. Now, the years I had the beard, I've never had a problem. Of course, that's not exactly true. Uh, my eyes water when it gets super cold like today. And I don't have facial hair underneath my eyes. And my eyes water and they drip and they freeze. That's the only part that gets cold. The rest of my face stays warm. Even with the little growth I have now. It's enough to keep it warm. Of course you could say I grow in the facial beard to hide my ugly. Could be. You know, I like to hide what's behind it, the ugly. Or you could say, and I've said this lots of times, I'm a man. This is what men do. Yeah. We grow in beards. It's our God-given right to have the beard. I stand behind that 100%. That's why I always have this. Some people love it. Some people hate it. I'm also one of the very lucky ones that my wife doesn't have a problem with this. But even if she did, she wouldn't tell me because she's that kind of woman. And, of course, this time of year, uh, I get called Santa. Well, I'm not Santa. I'm Santa Claus's brother, twin brother. Well, almost twin. I'm evil Santa. Actually, the real Santa is my real brother. Mm -hmm. He has the white beard as well. Yeah. And he's actually played Santa Claus before. He has a, Really? Of course, I like to tell you, not all them years that I've had the long goatee and the beard, that everything was all hunky and dory. It, I had a lot of issues. I used to get a lot of split ends. And it's just, mm, especially right now when it's growing in, there's a lot of itch there. But I found something two years ago I never used until two years ago. Beard oil. Beard oil is a must because it moistens the beard. It keeps down the split ends. And when you're growing in the beard, listen to me, guys. If you're going to grow the beard, get you some beard oil and put it on that brand new beard coming in. It takes down a lot of that itch. Of course, right before I shave this off, you're going to see me all burred out. As a matter of fact, I don't touch it because I leave it all burred out because it catches all all that wind it's like the little fuzzy thing on microphones to keep out the wind out of the microphone that's what the beard is exactly like that and sometimes it gets so bad right before i cut it i can see it out the corner of my eye and it really drives me nuts you'll see if you go back to last year and the year before that oh yeah <laughs> when it comes to march i'll be it's time to go back down to the goatee so guys this is what this video is about it's winter time if you do anything outside, and if you could get away with it with your work or with your wife, grow into facial beard. Yeah. You'd be thinking, you'd be thankful you did. Because it's the best thing in the world to keep your face warm. And you don't have to have it, excuse me, you don't have to have it all bushy, no. Like I said, what little bit of growth I got this moment is working. But it's going to grow in a heck of a lot more. Oh, yeah. I've only been growing this for, what, about two weeks now? Maybe three? No, it's only been two weeks. And believe me, it's growing fast. It's, it's like a weed. <laughs> so, guys, 
that's that's pretty much it, man. That's it. That's it. That's it. We're hoping to do some trails this weekend if it ain't rainy or the wind ain't going to kick our butts. You know, we're going to try to get some type of trail adventure. And I like to do other adventures where I go around different towns and show you things, you know. I thought that would be kind of cool, too. And I think they're getting ready to start the construction over here. Whoop, the sun was right there. Let me get back. I think they're getting ready to start construction over here. Yeah, on the new pool. I'll get that on video when they do. Until next time, guys, come on! We see you on our next adventure.